I have faith in you, babe. I do. It's the faith that my mom and my family have in me, more than the faith I have in myself that keeps me going. The reality show Alaskan Bush People has gained immense popularity, not only for the Brown family's impressive survival skills, but also for the tight-knit bond they share. However, the tragic passing of Billy Brown and the devastating fire in the Alaskan woods have shaken their passion for living in the mountain-covered wilderness. These events have had a profound impact on both the family and their dedicated fans. In the aftermath, the Brown family has also split apart. Noah Brown has moved to Washington with his children and wife, while Amy, Joshua, Solomon, Gabe, Amora and Mary are still building their lives in Washington State and Alaska. However, everyone has their eyes on the Brown family's oldest kid, Matt Brown. So let's find out what happened to Matt Brown from Alaskan bush people. <laughs> I melted the hammer! Okay, controlling the excitement. <laughs> The Brown family's incredible enthusiasm for the show made it a hit, and audiences adored their charming chemistry very much. From Billy Brown passing down survival skills to his kids, to Gabriel Brown's assistance in running the ranch with his mother, the family has consistently displayed love and support for one another. This tight-knit bond allowed them to endure the harsh temperatures of Alaska, finding warmth in the love they shared with each other. Though all of the children of the Brown family were exceptions, one of them had a special notorious fan base, and that was the reason he left the show after season 8. He's none other than the eldest child of the family, Matt Brown, who was born to Amy and Billy Brown on September 7, 1983 in Texas, and was brought up in the city life until he was 3 years old. After that, Billy took his wife and son to Alaska to live the rest of his life in the wild. In childhood, Matt learned from his mum and observed his father working on the ranch, inspiring him to help out when he grew up. When the Brown family joined Alaskan Bush People, Matt quickly gained fame as the most talkative member of the show. Amidst the show's success, fans began to notice Matt's sudden absence, which sparks concerns and curiosity about his whereabouts. Eventually, he left the show, and although it was addressed, the family rarely spoke about it, leading some fans to believe he was forgotten. Meanwhile, the other Brown kids were occupied with marriages and mapping out their future plans. Amy Brown, their mum, had a lot on her plate too, with grandchildren arriving and dealing with her husband's passing and health issues. So when Matt Brown departed, it didn't attract much attention at first, but there was rather a suspicious reason behind it all, which was later revealed. A few years back, Matt's relationship with his parents grew distant as he battled with his addiction. So he took the first step towards recovery and entered rehab to address his struggle with addiction. During that time, Matt openly admitted to feeling lost and withdrawn, lacking the excitement he once had for life. After spending 35 days in an inpatient treatment center, he managed to turn his weaknesses into strengths. Reflecting on his journey, he acknowledged that getting lost is a part of life, but not everyone finds their way back. Fortunately, he felt grateful to be one of those who did make it back on track. However, he was eventually removed from the show. The main reason must be because Matt was embroiled in a scandal after facing accusations of physically hurting two women in 2008. The allegations came to light while he was undergoing his second stint in rehab, with both women asserting that the incident occurred while Matt was heavily intoxicated. The first accuser, Jessica Jurgis, revealed in an exclusive interview with the US Sun that she was a former personal assistant to the reality TV family. Adding to the gravity of the situation, another woman, Shelley Dawn Early, who was Matt's then manager, also stepped forward with a similarly harrowing story. She asserted that just three days later, on the same premises in Canoga Park, Los Angeles, Matt also took advantage of her while he was heavily intoxicated. The two women reported these incidents to LAPD's Tonga division, and the case was handed over to the DA, who declined to prosecute. Due to that, Matt was fired from the family show and was never invited back. After leaving this show, Matt chose to share details about his life and experiences on Instagram and YouTube. While surprising fans, he revealed that he managed to reconcile with his late father Billy before his passing. However, the former reality star also made some shocking allegations. 
Matt claimed that his battles with addiction were partly influenced by the show's production, stating that they provided him with substances. Additionally, he asserted that the show was staged and not entirely authentic, confirming long-standing speculations from fans. Despite Matt's claims, neither the family nor Discovery has addressed the situation publicly. When the rest of the Brown family moved to Washington State in 2018, Matt didn't join them as he was attending an inpatient recovery program. Thankfully, Matt has stayed committed to his path of recovery and appears to be doing well at present. Now, fans no longer need to wonder about Matt Brown's whereabouts or what he's up to. He frequently shares updates on YouTube and Instagram about his life off the grid, seemingly in Washington although it appears that Matt might be residing close enough to his family to visit them. However, the status of his relationship with them remains unclear. After leaving this show, Matt took up work on a farm to support himself financially. While living in the small town of Loomis with only 101 residents, Matt manages to keep a low profile. Most of his days are spent on the farm, but he occasionally needs to head into town for grocery shopping. Interestingly, even though his siblings and mother also reside in Loomis, Matt never runs into them. It's been reported that Noah, Gabe, Rain and Snowbird Brown are not on speaking terms with their older brother, which must be difficult for Matt. Despite the wolf pack's disconnection, Matt seems to find contentment in his secluded lifestyle. The controversial figure of the Brown family has been sharing about his sobriety, celebrating two years of staying sober in 2022. It appears that he wants to spread a positive message and inspire his fans to embrace their best selves. During his free time on the farm, he takes pleasure in hiking up Chapaca Mountain and even camps there overnight to immerse himself in the beauty of nature. The Brown family has been depicted navigating life after the heart-wrenching loss of Billy. As some of the Brown children try to return to Alaska, Bird has been dealing with significant medical challenges. Surprisingly, despite all of them residing in the same small Washington town, Amy and her offspring have not mentioned Matt. Currently, Matt is keeping to himself while holding on to the hopes of reconciling with his family in the future. According to reports, Matthew's financial situation has significantly declined since he was reportedly cut from the show, resulting in the loss of his paycheck. In an Instagram video, he candidly shared that he's currently facing financial hardships and struggling to make ends meet. Moreover, he expressed that he doesn't have much money and even has limited access to food. Besides, Matthew alleged that the family made a substantial amount of money from the show. However, due to his father's control over the finances, all the earnings went to his father and subsequently his family. Matt's limited access to his own earnings became a significant challenge for him. He further stated that the family withheld more than $300,000 from him. Despite his allegations, no one from the family came forward to confirm the claims. The journey of Matt Brown from Alaskan bush people has been marked by controversy, struggles and allegations of financial disputes within the family. As fans continue to wonder about his future, one thing remains certain. The enigmatic tale of Matt's life after the show will keep people curious for years to come.